there and welcome back to my channel and as you can see something has changed in my room Ooh. but welcome to fitness journey getting back into my fitness journey video number 17 let's see what we've gone up to this week and let's continue with the video i'll catch you all at the end for a quick brief summary
okay. He, he took his slowly coming back. I just freaked out for a second then. And it probably was a global glitch because all around the world just had it. And my views are coming back, which is good. I can see the likes, which is great. And you think to yourself, for fuck's sake, what the hell? I really hope that Australia reconsiders not banning TikTok because I understand more how much that I actually rely on this to get me through lockdown. And especially with my mental health, you know, I enjoy watching so many, many people's contacts. Well, content. Guys, if, if this happens in Australia, I'm going to go mental. Legit. Legit. But hopefully every, everything's coming back now. Mm, today's not going to be fun. <laughs> Okay, is it just me or does 2020 just want to pull us through so much shit this year that it's not funny? Um, I'm already worked up with what's happening with Nara Rivera at the moment, so that has already worked me up. Now this happened and I almost had a panic attack. It's like, fuck me, man. But let's all breathe in and out. Okay, breathe in. TikTok is not over just yet. Let's all breathe. Let's all calm down. And let's all keep rocking our content. I love you all. I'm going to go calm myself down. But other than that, I'll see you soon. See you all soon. <laughs>
just like that, two weeks have gone past and now we can sit and calmly reflect. Now, what I've noticed in so many of these videos that the end takes a lot longer than, you know, the other videos and sometimes I have to cut it down into two parts because I'm not uploading like 40 to 60 minute videos. It's just never gonna happen. So, let's have a rundown. So, Monday and Tuesday are the last days of um, June and then Wednesday is the first month of july so let's yak about it so monday made it to my third team fearless team call which i was so proud i did the upper low body 30 minute workout we had amazing notes amazing tips and we had an amazing dance party at the end and i did eight and i slept so tuesday again the last day of june i ate watched youtube and um apparently a lot more to my notes um now when i did get up to do work on that tuesday into wednesday morning um youtube drama between james charles tati shane dawson and um and including um Jeffree Star, that's the person I was looking for, that all started to go rogue again, but it was in Tati's words. Now, I do believe Tati because, you know, I am a victim of abuse myself, and no matter what age that you are, you can be manipulated to believe something that actually could actually be wrong, or could also be right in retrospects. Now, I did do a video as we go into Wednesday. I released a video called Tati Breaks Her Silence, I Forgive You, and about stopping cancel culture. Now, with my Shane, um, Shane Dawson and Jeffree Star 2019 series, I'm actually gonna wait a bit longer to do that series only because I want this all to blow over first and then what I'm planning on doing is that I will be doing a cancer culture video that with all of the scrubbing into it as I have been getting information over um, 2020. Um, hopefully all of this will be more passed in 2021, which is now, but um, we want to realize that this is not okay. But continuing on, I organized myself for an amazing month and I ate and I slept. So Thursday joined another team call meeting, which was so much fun. And basically what it was, it was about getting into the business of Herbalife and looking at so many other people who have been into Herbalife and joining. And if you want to know more, I'll put my coaches links down below for you guys so you can go check that out. I'm still sort of someone who's more focused on the products and the results more than the actual earning the money because I want to learn that a lot more. And as we're continuing, we did have our burn um Grey um, Motivation Live with Rebecca and that was before that team call which was really really cool. Felt great. I was playing video games at the same time and I got so pumped to do it. Now um, I did ate some food and I started to slowly say goodbye to junk food because over these last months of 2020 I'm saying goodbye and then when it comes to 2021 no more because I'm getting sick of it and not only that like I said play games watched YouTube and made makeup videos which I was very proud of that so Friday watched YouTube organized edits um, and then things were going on on that Friday that kind of sucked and that lead into you know Saturday and most of this particular weekend but um I did a did a lot of my mindfulness work and on Friday with the food that I ate and even though I, I tried to eat it again on Saturday I felt sick for nearly a day and a bit but I was okay up to a nap on Saturday so my cousin came down we chilled we play games we watched Lost which is something that I haven't watched in years 
um, then I fell asleep but I only had two naps and that's all that I had and into Sunday um, my cousin was still over but he went home around um, 9 as my mum and Aunty Shell came home after a night of stressing and I finally fell asleep after only getting four hours of sleep from the previous day and I did watch the new all Sight episode on that day. So Monday didn't join the call but I mainly catch up on sleep because I was so tired for from the weekend. Um, and as, as I'm, I'm continuing, I made some um, makeup videos that's according to my notes. Now going on to Tuesday, so Tuesday, TikTok didn't, was going to, and on that week, TikTok didn't get banned. Yay. Um, got my period after two days of worrying because there's days when I would miscalculate when I put in for my period, which I think a lot of us will go through and um, lucky I have a flow tracker to help me out which is great um, so I ate, chilled, watched YouTube and slept um, next one so Wednesday I um, played around with my slats, my snapchat filters which I love mucking around with I, I ate, I did the dishes for the first time while on my period which is amazing which is really 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 good for me um, had a rewarding shower afterwards then rewatched all of the all star episodes and then ate and slept thursday again i ate did some youtuber stuff as i um got bored and that was true on my period i can get very very bored i was going to take the day off that day nope um restarted watching pretty little liars season four which i'm still up to this too eight but eventually felt sick again now this is a recurring thing i've been seeing over the last three months that i just do not feel well and um hopefully within the next lot of um weeks i will be going to a doctor's getting my back rechecked mental health free sorted out and to get my blood test done which we will be organizing over hopefully in the next weeks um friday stayed up because i felt a bit ill which was true try to eat the dinner again but then didn't go well like happened last week tiktok had a major glitch and everyone was freaking freaking out including one but eventually i calmed down and this was the day that we around the two days in a week that we found out that um glisa nira rivera went missing and unfortunately a week later they found her body and confirmed that she did die um of drowning and she was trying to save her son which i knew that because um it didn't make sense of her leaving her son alone for four hours and it's obvious that she had enough strength to push her son onto the boat and all the Glee fans around the world including myself are still heavily upset and by this stage as I'm recording the video she's been passed away over a week and um it's just really 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 hard to have this end because um on the day that it was confirmed that she passed away, which was Monday the 13th in the US time zone. Was around kind of the same day that Corey passed away seven years ago. And it broke all, all of our hearts. A lot of Glee fans around the world are still heavily upset, including myself. I'm already getting teary because I love her and I miss her. I've always wanted to, um, you know, get her book, which I will be. Um... But um, it was really, really, really highly upsetting. And um, yeah, I can go on about it. And it's going to make me more and more heavily upset. But please send love, not hate to her family. Um, and disrespect this face as well. Um, continuing on, I, because of the glitch with TikTok and also with everything that was going on with her, 
I stayed up most of the day feeling really ill to my stomach. Um, TikTok did not get banned in Australia and I reward myself by getting new TikTok music and it also was the 10 year anniversary on YouTube which was awesome but then I forgot the very next day and I did eight I wrote my 10 years um post which I forgot to do true i um, edited 13 videos in 10 hours played around with my snapchat filters which was true because doing that was a lot of work um did i post my sap my snapchat photos of june which was fun as well watch stan um youtube and i finally went to bed so basically it has been great this whole nearly two weeks of this particular vlog which is amazing but towards the end with the you know with all the crap that, that was with tiktok all of everything that was with um naya rivera dying you know it has taken a toll on me and you will see more of that in um the next um vlog 18 which will be coming out very very soon um, thank you so much for joining me for this video. All of my socials, my YouTube series links are all down below. Um, go check out um, the annotation at the end of the video, which will be a recent upload. And the um, fitness journey playlist or the blog playlist, whatever one I choose. And the music that was played in this entire video will be right after this part of the video remember to take care of yourself hug your loved ones because tomorrow is not promised i love you all and i'll see you all in another couple of weeks for me for you guys will probably be the week will probably be next week but other than that i love you all remember to hit that subscribe button if you do like my content and hit that notification bell for to see what i upload but other than that i love you all and i catch you all soon